Pluto was once known as a planet, but since scientists discovered it failed to meet one of the three requirements defined by the IAU in order to be classified as a planet, so Pluto is now known as a dwarf planet. Click on the link below for interesting facts about Pluto. Ceres is the only dwarf planet in the asteroid belt. It is the smallest identified dwarf planet in our solar system. Ceres was discovered in 1801 by Giuseppe Piazzi. For half a century after its discovery, Ceres was classified as the eighth planet in our solar system. It is named after Ceres, the Roman goddess of motherly love. Ceres is by far the largest and most massive body in the asteroid belt. It contains almost a third, 32% of the asteroid belt's total mass. Ceres has a very primitive surface, like a young planet. It contains water-bearing minerals, frost, possibly a very weak atmosphere. The dwarf planet rotates quite fast on its axis, so one day on Ceres would be just over 9 Earth hours long. Ceres is made of a mixture of water ice and various hydrated minerals, such as carbonates and clays. Ceres contains a rocky core and ice mantle, and may harbour an ocean of liquid underneath its surface. Ceres is too small to see with the naked eye. NASA will be launching the Dawn Space Probe to explore the dwarf planet in 2015. Ceres has no known moon. One day on Himea is incredibly short, lasting only 3.9 Earth hours long. Himea is named for the Hawaiian goddess of birth and fertility. Himea is an elongated object, which is rather unusual for a dwarf planet. It is believed that its fast rotation is the cause for its odd shape. Unlike most objects in the Kuiper Belt, Himea is not an equal mixture of ice and rock, but it has a thin icy crust covering a rocky interior. The name Himea alludes to its structure, since the goddess Himea is also associated with stone. Himea has a large red spot on its surface, which may be an impact crater that has revealed the dwarf planet's interior. Himea has two known moons, both discovered in 2005. They are called Namaka and Iaka. Himea was discovered in 2004 and was named a dwarf planet in 2008. Namaka was named after one of Himea's daughters. Namaka is the smaller inner moon of the dwarf planet Himea. Namaka was discovered on the 30th of June 2005 and was finally announced that year on November 29th. Namaka was nicknamed Blitzen by the Discovery Team before receiving an official name. Namaka is only 1.5% as bright as its dwarf planet Himea and is about 0.05% its mass. Iaka is the larger outer moon of the dwarf planet Hamir. Hayaka was the first satellite discovered around Hamir. 
The moon was named after Hayaka, one of Hamiya's daughters. Hayaka was originally nicknamed Rudolph by its discovery team. Hayaka was discovered in 2005. Makai Makai is the third largest known dwarf planet in our solar system. It is one of the two largest Kuiper Belt objects. Makai Makai's diameter is roughly three quarters that of Pluto. Makai Makai has no known moons, which makes it quite unique among the largest Kuiper Belt objects. Its extremely low average temperature means that its surface is covered with methane, ethane and possibly nitrogen ices. Makemake Make was discovered on March 31, 2005 by a team led by Michael Brown and announced on July 29, 2005. Makemake Make was formally classified as a Plutoid in July 2008. A Plutoid is a trans-Neptunian dwarf planet See below for more info. It is about a fifth as bright as Pluto. Despite its relative brightness, Make Make was not discovered until well after much fainter Kuiper Belt objects. Make Make is currently the second brightest Kuiper Belt object after Pluto. Spectral analysis of Makemake's surface revealed that methane must be present in the form of large grains at least one centimeter in size. In addition, large amounts of ethane and tholins must be present as well, most likely created by photolysis and methane by solar radiation. Because it is so far away, Makemake takes nearly 310 years to orbit the Sun once. Make Make was discovered soon after Easter in 2005. The astronomers nicknamed it Easter Bunny. When they chose an official name, they decided they should choose a character from the mythology of Easter Island. Make Make is very, very cold. The temperature there is about minus 240 Celsius, minus 406 Fahrenheit. Make Make appears to be red in color, which is quite strange seen as the dwarf planet's surface is covered in ice, containing methane and possibly ethane. Make Make's surface is puzzling. Scientists aren't 100% positive whether the dwarf planet has an atmosphere or not, but they have come to a possible conclusion. They think that where Make Make is close to the sun within its orbit, the gases on the dwarf planet heat up and rise to create an atmosphere. And when the planet is furthest from the sun, the gases freeze and fall like snow, therefore having no atmosphere. They believe this happens on Pluto as well. Eris is the largest known dwarf planet in our solar system. It is the ninth most massive body known to orbit the Sun directly. Eris was first identified in January 2005 by a Palomar Observatory base team led by Mike Brown and its identity verified later that year. It is a trans-Neptunian object native to a region of space beyond the Kuiper Belt known as the Scattered Disk. As of 2011, its distance from the Sun is roughly three times that of Pluto. With the exception of some comets, Eris is the most distant known natural object in the solar system. Because Eris appeared to be larger than Pluto, its discoverers and NASA initially described it as the solar system's 10th planet. This, along with the prospect of other similarly sized objects being discovered in the future, motivated the IAU to define the term planet for the first time. The discovery was announced on July 29, 2005, the same day as Makemake and two days after Hermia. Eris's orbit is very different compared to other known objects in our solar system. 
As you can see, Eris orbits the sun in a completely different way, travelling downwards. Eris has one known moon, called the Snow Moon. 